What is up everybody, welcome back, as you can see, back on the beach, back got our rock again, rad suit, okay, not a bad start, yeah, back again, I'm sorry the last wipe was so short, basically I had some stuff going on in my personal life sort of thing, I was moving into my house, still not fully moved in yet, moving in this weekend, but hopefully now we can get a good long wipe going this week, because the last one I think was like two episodes, so yeah, we are starting once more, and this this server as we know is, is pretty vicious, so I'm not quite sure whereabouts I want to set up. I haven't had a look at ch a chance to look at the map yet, but I'm hoping maybe we desert again. We always go desert though, but it's just got so many good nodes. It's just how it is. Ventured Snowward Bound. Plenty of nodes around here, so that's good. There's a couple of bases nearby. A couple of people shot at me with bows, so really it's it's obviously like always. It's a, it's a hectic area, but everywhere on this server is. But there are a few nodes around, so. Likewise, things are not too bad. I'm thinking I get a little starter base down if I can. Try and get some tools together. I'm gonna need to find some animals. That's gonna be a bit of a problem. But if we can get a little two by two down with a key or something, we should be good. Stupid bear making me go on a damn chase for you. Let's get some wood. Try and get a little base down. Even if it's just made of wood and it's just a piece of crap, that's fine with me. I haven't got anywhere near enough wood. Close that. Craft a key. Right! The uh, rubbishy little 2 by one is almost almost there. We're going to need a TC, but right now it's all wooden, so that's good. I haven't got a lot of wood, but maybe that's enough. I don't know. And let's just get that cooking so we can try and get a code lock down. Whew. God, it's been a tricky start, guys. I'll tell you what, I'm going to need to go and get a load of wood because I've not even got enough for a small storage box unless I rob some of this. God, it's been a... Uh, Bit of a more tricky start, I've not showed you it all, because I'm trying to speed this up, I don't want this episode to be kind of like all the others. I want this to be a little bit more, a little bit more excitement, a little bit more enjoyable, whatever, but now we've got this down, we've got a little bit of a foothold on the, on the server, if you will. Get these cooking, hope for the best that we can get them, get a code lock on quickly, and then we'll go from there. Alright, I've been out, my hatchet's broken, I've managed to grab a little bit more wood, so I've topped the furnace up, that's going, but I'm going to need to go out somewhere and try and get and more, some more metal ore, so I'm going to have to go and hit some nodes, that's fine, once we've got the code lock on we should be good on that. So I'm going to place this TC down, and then we'll go from there. We'll plump that, do we want it this way actually maybe? That should be good, try and get a second furnace in there. Ooh, sugar, because I've placed it that way around, does that mean I'm not going to be able to try and get a code lock if I code lock it? Ah, oh, shucks, I'm going to have to destroy it at some point. Oh well. Right, look at all of these nodes here. I'm counting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 nodes just here and a horse. So I'm going to have to grab some of these up right now so that I can upgrade the base. So we'll get that to stone, maybe put some more wood in the furnace and some more metal ore and stuff, and then we want to go out. Probably, maybe PvP, I don't know. I'm pretty poor at PvP as you guys probably know by now, so we'll see, we'll see. Right, so, status report. There's a guy building the base just over the crest there, really close to mine. And he's very good with the boat. So we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna glance over that. But I found this little thing here, right? Which is a one by one with a triangle on it, and it's got a key lock. Now I watched a video today, I've known about it for a while, but you you know like key key lock rating? Key 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 rating, key lock rating, whatever it is. Um, and I watched a video today by my friend Snow. I'll drop a link to the video in the description. It's really, really good sort of guide of how to key lock raid on Rust. And honestly, I've, I really enjoyed the video and it's made me really want to go and do it and give it a go at key lock raiding. Now, I hear it's a lot of wood. It's a lot of time. You've got to make a sugar ton of keys, but I think we can do it. I think it could be good. I'm, I'm thinking if I can do it. Oh, shit. There he is. Look. I've got nothing but a rock with me. And I'm going to die a cold anyway. See, look, there's his base, look. Mm. But yeah, I'm thinking if we can do it then, we fucking quids in. Right, I went out, grabbed 859 wood. That's not loads, but it'll have to do. Let's chuck a little bit in there, just so we can keep going on frags. Now, I still need stone, so that's, that's always great. Right, what I'm going to do is spend the night 
crafting up some keys here on this box. So I think if I craft a lock, this is kind of how you do it, I think. Yeah, it is. So I think basically all you do is create key, rem unlock with key, remove lock, drop again, create key, unlock with key, remove lock. And then I should have two different keys. Basically, guys, the point of it is there's only like a hundred different key combinations you can get in Rust. So if you do this like over and over again, get a full inventory of keys. Damn, I burnt the bear meat. I can't afford to do that, which I'm doing now. Basically, one of them is going to open the door, basically. Law of averages. So I shall get a sugar ton of keys here and be back with you in the morning when I can see to get over there. Right, so I'm just waiting for morning. I've crafted this many keys. This is all I can craft because um, I'm out of wood now. But I need to craft some co clothes up. So I've got the shirt and I'm crafting the trousers. We'll take a little... Oh, can you not put it on from your hotbar? We'll take a little trip over and see what we can do with these keys. If it works, fucking awesome. I'll give it another go. Um, I don't want to give up on it that easy because I've just wasted like a K wood on this shit. But we'll, we'll see, we'll see. Hey, look, this guy's got a key lock as well. Should we see if we can key raid him? <laughs> it worked! It genuinely fucking worked! Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Nat Ninja. I am so sorry. You've got sweet Fanny Adams. But oh my god, I'm gonna kill you as my first my first key raid kill. Right, actually, yeah, I'll kill you. Destroy your bag. I can't believe that worked, guys. Literally the this it was just randomness. I didn't even fucking know this base was really here. I knew he was building it because we saw it a minute ago. But wow. Why was he offline? He was only just on. Oh, destroying bags just wrecks these tools, doesn't it? Christ almighty. Right, I'm going to leave the loot here. And by the loot, I mean... I mean, there's not a lot here, is there, really? Let's actually grab that key. Yeah, he's not got a lot. I'll give him that. Right, so I know which key is this guy's key. It's this one. So I don't chuck it away. And, yeah, we'll leave the loot in this box and go and try that other one, yeah? Yeah, fucking hell. i tell you what, if I can get two for two on this key rating for the first time of doing it, oh my god, my dreams will have come true. Literally everything that I've ever wanted in Rust could come so easy. If only that guy could have had some better loot, everything would have been better. Right, come on, everybody cross actually everything right now. No, doesn't work with this door, unfortunately. Fudge. Right, we're going to have to go back. Craft a load more keys up. Easily done, though. Right, what I'll do, actually. Yeah, yeah, we'll go back. I'll dump these keys, despawn them in the house so people don't know what I'm doing. Right, so there's a bear outside, which is grand. Right, I'm not going to need any of these keys anymore. So they're all naff skis. Don't need any of that crap. I'll go and get a load more wood, and then we'll, we'll go again. We'll craft a load more. Alrighty then, let's uh, let's go again then, I guess. Create a key, unlock with key, remove lock. God, this is tedious. Right, keys are made. We're all Gucci, Rucci, Bucci right now. All new set of keys. Ouch. And I guess, turn that off with its three wood. We'll go and see what we can do. I'm going to leave this here and hope for the best. Actually, let's unlock that so I can uh, do it again next time. Oh shit, <laughs> we're in! Well, I say we're in, I can't even jump through the door. That's fucking incredible, guys. I am fucking loving this key lock raid and stuff. What? Why are there two guys? Oh my god. There are two guys in here, so there you go. Boom, straight off the bat, teamers. Just, why, man? On a solo-only server, what is the point? Obviously, you get that advantage, but it's just, it's just pointless. Why? I mean... I don't know. There are plenty of other servers for you to go on and just don't be a dick on this one. I don't I don't get it. I'm going to destroy this bag. I'll ban the both of them um, at the end because fuck them. I, can't, I just what don't join the server if you get a team, guys. Right, we got um actually I can just sack off all of these keys. Have you got it? Whoa! Fucking look at all that. <laughs> look at all that shit. That's awesome. Oh, security camera. Nice. Either of you guys got a key on you. No, but you've got a bow. I did need one of those. And a bit of better helmet protection. That is tasty. What? Why has he got an SMG body? Oh, he's got a rad suit on. He's just been to the rad town. Oh, that's sick. Right, so I've got plenty of cloth now. I've got some tools so I can destroy the bag. 
there's his key that I want so that I can just make sure that I can get out again. So I'll sack... Which one was it? That one? So I'll sack off the rest of these keys. This is incredible. Guys, this new key raiding thing is my new absolute favourite. I've never done it before and honestly, the success we've had today has just been something monumental. I didn't know it was this easy. I will never put a key lock on my base again. This is just absolute madness. Right. I'm going to destroy this bag first and we'll go from there. Alright guys, let's touch the loot. So this guy's got nothing and this guy's got all of the juicy stuff. Right, is that going to be enough stone to do up our base? I don't know. We need cloth, we need the SMG body. Look at that. 15 pipes, man. I don't know whether to just take this base, guys. Because to be honest, has he got a furnace? No, they've not got a furnace. So that could be an issue in the long run. Take some of those, take that. I guess we'll take his rad suit as well. We've got one, but you can never have too many. Take those, take the scrap. Right. I'll tell you what. I have never been more proud of anything I've done in my life than a good key lock raid. I'm going to do them all the time. Massive props to Snow for telling, showing me how easy it fucking is. Right. Let's actually just load them up with metal ore. I don't need that key anymore. I think I'll keep it. I kept the one for the other base, so we'll keep that one as well. I'm going to need a large box or something first. Let's get one of them. Oh, I've not got the wood. Right, okay, let's remove the lock on that. Let's stone up as much of this base as we can, just to make sure we don't get flamethrowered. Can I do the roofs? Yes, I can. Love it. Right, so we've now got stone, so I'm going to need an airlock. I still need a metal door. I need wood for all of that, plus the ability to bloody... Um, make a box. I need a fucking box, guys. That's all I need. Grab a load of wood, get the furnace cooking, Make it so we can make some doors or something, some more code locks. Make sure we can get some boxes down. And then we're good. Then we're pretty pretty tasty. I might make a water pipe or something. Might start cooking up the high qual to make a flipping Thompson. It's just it's just beautiful. I might make my own rad run. Who knows? Who knows? Alright, let's get that upgraded. Drop this Mr. Double Door down. Change the code lock. I've moved all the loot into this large box, so we're good now. Can I actually still place a some stairs in here? Ooh, so we can get a shelf going. Actually, how much wood's in... Oh, I'm sad. I don't have enough. Nice. Okay, so we're two sheet metal doors. Not really as much as I would like, but I'm having a bit of a hard time with it. My frags seem to be cooking so slowly today. I don't quite get it. Right. We're going to head out of the snow, I think. I need to get some water on my travels. We're going to head maybe this way. I don't know. I want to kill a guy. We killed no one yet. We're, we're, not, we're not pulling our weight around here. Dude with the hatchet, dude with the hatchet. Have you got any wood that you could spare for me, dude? Dude, okay. The fuck? What the fuck? Fucking weenuses, man. Right, God, okay. Someone's got a gun somewhere. Could do with banking this spare bow, actually. Maybe trying to health up a little bit, but... Looks like we're heading straight out into battle. I don't know. What? How many times do you gotta hit these kids, these idiots, man? Please say this is gonna fit the- Oh, yes, boys. Right, I don't know what to do with this base. I don't know whether to make it a 2x2 two two or just dog a triangle on there. Because if, if I put a triangle on there, then it's gonna be like a starter base. If I put make it a 2x2, two two, we can branch out from there. It's, it's a tricky one. Do I have the stuff for a ladder hatch? I think I do, really. So I could do ladder hatch if I wanted tonight on this 2x2 two two and just leave it and hope we don't get raided overnight. That could be a thing. I think that's going to be a thing, to be honest. And then we can go and build either a main base or make this into a main base tomorrow. But come the morning, I'm going to head over to either the dome or if I grab a bit of wood and craft a map, I think there's a nearer rad town than that. We made it here pretty safe, so that's always good to know. If we can come here, 
freely and like, recycle our stuff, that would be... Ooh, look at that drop. <sighs> Wooden stuff's on this side. So I think that means we should, theoretically, be good. Oh. All right then. That's that's great banter. That. All right. I brought my bag inside. That scared the living daylights out of me. You guys have absolutely no idea. Christ Almighty God. Right. Let's go dome. <laughs> Why didn't it shoot again? I'm gonna say, what what happened there? All right, Bo, calm down. Calm down, my son. Let's get rid of these bad boys. I'm gonna go two by two just to be sure. Get a door there, do you think? Yeah. I can make that one wooden, I suppose. And put a ladder hatch there when I can. It's got a lot of armor on, I've got like 10 arrows. Headshot him. Fucking got him. Okay, you got lucky, man. Did I? Oh, security camera, nice. Nice set of gear. Alright. Obviously, I want to try and do another shop. Obviously, that's that's a given, right? But I'm thinking maybe we do something a little bit different this wipe. Like, I'm thinking... I don't, I don't want to spoil the surprise. It's going to be a bit of a surprise if I can get it right. But I'm quite excited. That's going to be my mission for tomorrow. Right now, I want to make sure that I can get another door on here. I need to make this stone, so I need to go farm up a couple more nodes. Get a door on there, so we've got like three doors to loot, which should be nice. I think I'm going to end the episode there, guys. I'm sorry if it was a little bit more slow-paced, but it's been a bit of a difficult white day. And I like to make sure that you guys sort of are in, in I don't know what you'd say, like, in with me on this. We do this together sort of thing in these white days. It's like... I don't want to go. I'm not. I don't want to go through it alone, sort of thing. So you guys are on on the journey with me. So what I'm going to do is end the episode here. I'm probably going to go and do just a little bit of farming to get an airlock down, and then call it quits for the night because it's pretty late. But come the morn, well, I've got work. But after that, I'll be back on tomorrow night, and we're going to build our empire. That means anything that you guys think we can do with this base, it will happen. We're going to make it big. We're going to make it tall. We're going to go dominate the server. We're going to use this SMG body. It's going to be great. I'm going to recycle these as well. That should probably be good. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for all of your support recently. I cannot thank you guys enough. Um, if you did enjoy the video, drop a like down below. If subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think as always. And most of all guys, have a frippin' awesome day. And I'll catch you all in the next episode.